What is up, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid. Well, remember where we last left off? Um, I was doing a whole bunch of metal detecting. Well, I spent a few days doing that, and I collected quite a bit of steel. So there's a couple projects we're going to be able to do today. I got 33 steel. I could get more, even. Um, I still had some more batteries left, but I kind of got tired of uh, looking for more steel. So today, what we're going to really focus on is how many more steel pipes do we need? Well, I think I, ha I have five steel pipes because we want to make this water pump. We need ten total. That's not a problem. I think I can make five more um, without too much problem. Um, right now we have, let's see, uh, oh, I have some steel ingots here. So we have five uh, steel pipes. Now, just because it's been like a day since I was doing this, um, I don't remember exactly how to make um, the pipes, but I know I have to make sheets of metal first. So I need some tongs, work gloves, and the whatever. You know, that's not a problem. Tongs, work gloves, and the iron anvil. Uh, we'll get that real quick. Uh, let's get some tongs and work gloves. I put a whole bunch of them over here because I was moving stuff around pretty fast. Yeah, there they are. Okay, some work gloves. And then we'll just uh, pick up as many steel ingots, I guess, as we can. Because we have to make all these steel sheets and the large steel sheets. So, yeah, that's good enough. I I'm not going to make tons of those. So, um, we're making uh, a sheet of metal. Right? And that's the ones we want to make. We can make two of those. See, it takes four to do each one. Um, I think that's what we're, we're making. Because we're making a sheet of metal. Well, no, 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 no. We want to make... I just want to make sure it's the right thing. Yeah, okay, steel sheet, okay. So we'll craft two of those. That gives us another pipe. Um, I, I'll get more, don't worry. I think I don't know what I'm running uh, low on, actually. Uh, I guess steel ingots. I have, a, I have a ton here, man. I had like 31 of them here, so I'm not too worried about it. We'll just keep gathering them. Should eat a little food, too, while I'm at it. That shouldn't... There's more. Okay, yeah, I was going to say. There's more. I was going to say, I thought I had a lot more than that. Yeah. Should have enough. Oh, I have charcoal on me. I'm going to put the charcoal down. I don't need it right now. Um, Where's my food? I need to go grab some food real quick, guys. So, pardon me while I go grab a little bite to eat. Uh, let's see. I have a lot of emeries in here. And that's what I'm living off of right now. Kind of not really fun. But until I get this water up... I really don't, you know, until I get, there's a lot of projects you want to get done, and that's just the truth, you know, you just want to get a lot of these projects done so you don't have to be dealing with them anymore, because we have our wagon, and what, really what my aim is, is to eventually think about, uh, well, either making this into a massive huge base, or actually moving my base, maybe even, like, to downtown, or just going to another city altogether, it, you know, just be just be more like kind of like you know we get tired of the same area, so we might change areas or something like that. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and make the sheets of metal, and we can make three of them this time. That's fine. Okay, so now we have quite a bit of them. We need our welding stuff, so let's get that. And then there we go. All right. So now we're trying to make these uh, metal pipes. Well, we need a large sheet of metal. So we go to engineering, make large sheets of metal. We can make two of those. Okay. Come on. It takes its time, you know. Okay. So we got two of those. And then uh, we need, uh, we still should be able to do it right here. So we're out of uh, gas in our gas tank here. Uh, empty. Replace welding gas tank. Yeah. It does take its time, doesn't it? Okay, so should we should have an empty one in here. Oh, I was uh, putting all my empty batteries and empty uh, fuel cells and things like that. I'm just throwing in this barrel. I found a barrel while I was uh, while searching. Eventually, I'm going to use this barrel for crafting needs. Um, maybe uh, make my own biodiesel, things like that. Um, be kind of cool. But right now, it's... Uh, it's for dead batteries and empty welding gas <laughs> tanks and stuff. So that that's a thing right now for me. Um, we're making metal pipes. I just want to make sure they're the right ones. Okay. Craft two of those. So I do it from this menu because this menu tells you it's steel pipe. And I don't like seeing it saying metal pipe because then it's like, oh no. Do we have... Okay, so how many do we got? We got two more. Uh, it'll be close. I think we're going to use up most of our steel. So steel pipes... Um, wrong box, huh? 
five, six, seven. So we'll go pick up pick up some more of these uh, steel ingots. We're gonna use up a lot of these, and I'm probably gonna need to make more because I do want to make my uh, dissection table eventually. Because I do want to start working on that. I know it works now. So let's see. And there's been a lot added to it, and I really want to uh, play with that. Um, always do it in here. Make sheets of metal. Okay, craft four of those. That's fine. We'll use them for something. Making steel pipes are, is important. And then into engineering. Shark sheets. Craft two of those. That's going to give me two more. I'm going to be one shy right now. Okay. That's all right. We're just one shy right now. It's okay. Let's see. How many... Uh, so that should give me nine. Nine steel pipes. And we have one steel sheet right here. So we just need just a tad bit more. Is it a walk that I can recycle? I don't know. I have to take a look. Um... Let's put the steel sheet down for a second. Also, my welding stuff. Let's put that on the ground. And uh, see if we could recycle just a little bit more steel. Grab some charcoal. Uh, grab ingot mold. Um, I know I can make some more steel from... I have a lot of things, actually, to make steel from right now. I got two monkey wrenches. I don't need two. I just need one more. Actually, you know what? I, also, I, I realize you don't even use them up. So I just need one. I need the lunchbox will give me some steel. These saws, I don't need that many. I can get some steel from that. Because we just need one more sheet. And then that should be good, actually. I think we're all set. Okay, recycle steel from axe, uh, from saws. Uh, yeah, we'll do all four of those. And that's it. That's all we needed. So let's fast forward that real quick. Okay, so that's four of those. We'll grab those, pick those up. And then we come over here to the anvil. We make a metal sheet again. And then now that's two metal sheets. And to the welding stuff. And then we make a large sheet of metal. Okay. Ah, so much so much work just to get t 10 steel pipes, man. That's rough. That's a lot of I mean not only that, but it, I think it was like three more steel pipes for the water tower. Um, it, it, this this has been an overhaul to get to get this done has been this is just amazing this is just crazy I've never so much to do all right here's our last one then we'll put the charcoal down and stuff like that but that's the last one and then we have our monkey wrench on us I think we're all set okay so that's steel pipe uh, let's put the lunchbox away we'll put the charcoal on the ground and We'll grab all the steel pipes. I don't want to carry them on me. I just want the... I'll put them on my dog, I guess. So that's 10, ten steel pipes. Let's just make sure we're not going crazy here. Ah, uh, Alright, we got that. We need two lumber stacks, the four wooden beams. I think everything else is over there. I think I had it all set. I think we made all the wood beams, the wood shingles. Everything was all sitting there. Um, oh wait, we already made that. Um, what we were making is this. So we just need water tower. Yeah, okay, windmill. Okay, so we gotta pick up these windmills and water towers and stuff. Let's get some sleep for the night. This is a, this has been a long time coming. It's literally about three episodes of work uh, to get this water tower going, this water pump. But I'm, I'm excited to get it done. I mean, God, what an ordeal, though. Um, let's eat all that. Oh, I don't need... Do I need this welding? I probably don't. Uh, no, I don't need the welding. The welding stuff. We shall put it away, just because I don't want to have it on me. Let's just get this stuff away. Tank, it's empty. We got another empty tank there. Welding gas. It's fine. That can all go away. Uh, we'll put the tongs away. And work gloves. I could have well, I guess a walk is uh, for iron. I thought it was for steel. I don't know why. I was thinking that way. Okay, then we have to get our windmill and our well and hopefully be able to carry it with us okay empty well can we put it on us just like maybe on our pack dog oh it's gonna have to be on us okay that thing weighs 30 and this thing weighs 20 maybe i can get the okay windmill will go on the dog and then i'll carry the well how about that 
All right. Let's go out to our carpenter bench and stuff. Not that I need the carpenter bench, but all the rest of the stuff is out there. Oh my god. What an ordeal. It's finally over. I'm glad. Oh, look at oh, look at this. The ground is thawing. Oh, thank god. What is it? It's only uh February though, so we're still winter time. It'll probably snow again. All right. Let's see. That should be everything is right here. Oh, you know what? Where's my wooden beams and stuff? I guess I do have to still get that. Can I put the well down? No. I'm going to have to put the well down just for now. And we also need to put down the windmill, right? Yeah, let's put the windmill down. Okay, there's all of our stuff almost. And uh, But we do need... What we will need is, we're going to need, no, no, we don't need any of that. I thought we needed, uh, I was looking at the water tower, that's right. All right, um, that's everything then. That is everything. Let's see if I can get it all on me then. Let's get the empty well on me. Okay, and the windmill, we are, we, we carried it. Well, what well, doesn't matter, just carried it on the dog, I guess. I'm hoping it'll register that it's all in one area. Okay, let's take a look at this. Oh my god. Make a water pump, y'all. Here it is. Oh, and then I just need a wooden bucket and then you put a wooden bucket by it. From what I remember seeing, I remember seeing Nomas making one of these and uh this is cool. Oh, there we go. Look at that, guys. Oh my god. This thing is massive. There's our watering station. Now we can get water whenever we want. How heavy is this thing? It's only weighs 30. No, no. But what is so weird about that? Like, oh my god, do we have to, like, literally, we can't move it? Oh, okay, that's interesting. Because look, it's all set up here, like it's all put together. Hmm, water pump, yeah. And then it's saying I have a water tower. I just want the water pump. So can I just, well, take it all with me. Oh, that that is weird, isn't it? Oh, because it doesn't use these up? Oh, that's weird if it didn't use it up, right? Wouldn't that be weird? Because then I can make infinite... Like, look, look at this. Wait. If that's true... Like, water pump? Let me see. Yeah, look at that. So that's not... That's not working right, guys. Look at that. Because then I get an extra water tower and a water trough. Um, you can... Now, this is a glitch. I'll have to tell uh, Hydromancer about it. Water trough and water tower are staying. So then when I come over here... Well, that, that's just weird. I don't even know why these are staying. Oh, well. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out why that happened. But we're going to move this anyway, so take it with us. Yeah, look, I, I have an extra water trough and a wire tower. Not that I, I could use the trough. I definitely could use the trough, so I'm not worried about that. Did I need a trough? I mean, yeah, it, it, I did need a trough. I needed a um, water trough, and it should have used it up. And a windmill, and it didn't use up my water, or uh, the water tower and the water trough, it didn't use them up at all. I don't know what the glitch was, but for some reason they weren't used up. Um, where do I want to put this massive thing? I mean, I'd like to have it in here, but it's just not realistic, right? I mean, I should make another enclosement, like out, out right here or something. I'll probably do that. I'll put it out here for now. Hopefully zombies don't destroy it or something. And this, uh, we'll get water from over here for now. And uh, all I need is a bucket, from what I remember. A water bucket. Or just a, a wooden bucket. So let's grab a wooden bucket real quick. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Grab a wooden bucket, and then when you put the wooden bucket down, you should have, you should just get water, right? So, like, if I put the wooden bucket, like, down right beside it, and then, oh, no, I have, do I have to have it on me? I probably have to have it on me. And then, fill bucket. Awesome. All right, there we go. So, that's fresh water. Ha! Huh. That's amazing. Okay, we just pour that in our canteen whenever we need it. And there we go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I'll just put it down for now because we have the wooden bucket there. So, all right, there's our supply of water. We no longer need water barrels or anything like that. Um, you know, rain collectors and stuff like that. This, that's it right there. We just, uh, 
We just get free water now for uh, forever, forever, forever. No more worry about purifying water anymore. That's pretty cool. Um, so I have to think about what we're gonna do next. Um, I have this monkey wrench. Just to put a lot of these things away. Well, the dissection table is the next thing, but I didn't think I was gonna go through that much steel, and I'm gonna need. What do I need? Uh, st ten steel ingots. Hmm. I guess I could do that. We can make the dissection table too, because I do want to dissect some uh, zombies, and we'll do that some of that today, actually. Uh, so we got our water tower. I'm gonna move it. If you notice right there, it's kind of cropping the the roof a little bit, so I might move it a little bit. Um, also, you know, I've been talking about sprucing up the place, making it a little bit nicer, making an actual nice room for me. Uh, maybe making my own bedroom and stuff. That'd be kind of nice. So I think I might do that too, but not today. Um, dissection table is the first thing today that we're going to work on. And I'll see you guys in a bit once I get the 10 uh, steel ingots. Because I don't think you guys need to watch me get steel ingots. All right. Be right back. All right, you guys, I'm back, and I got all the ingots I need. I, got, I have 17. All I need was 16. Um, I do got to pick these up, though. Um, then I got to make these steel rods. Um, the large, uh, These steel rods require four pieces of steel each, which is why I was saying I needed 16. Um, to make steel rod, we're going to need the smithy hammer, tongs, work gloves, and the anvil. So we'll make all four of those now. And there we go. So we should have four steel rods on us. Awesome. And we have one extra steel ingot. We'll go ahead and put that away for now. Um, another thing I'm going to need is two large sheets of metal. Which, um, it just says large sheets of metal. So I just need these sheets of metal right here. Um, because I don't need... It didn't say large steel sheet of metal. It just said large sheet of metal. So I'm assuming that we can do that with just with regular uh, sheets here. And then we're going to need, um, to empty this, replace welding gas tank. Oh, I have too much on me. I'm going to put this on the ground for now. And then let's go ahead and do that. And then we're going to need our welding mask and then get this done with. Oh, did I get it on me? Welding mask? No, I didn't. Uh, what else should I move? I, I should move some things around anyways. I got too much weight on me. Just shy. Okay, so we should be able to make large sheets of metal here. We need the anvil? Oh, make sheet of metal. No, I want to make right here. Um, hmm. Welding gas tank with the units. Well, I thought I replaced it. Oh, I didn't have enough space to replace it on me. Okay, now that's all right. Um, we'll put the rods down. They're, they're weighing me out a little bit. So let's go ahead and replace that now. Okay. All right, as I say, something was wrong here. All right, and why do I have a metal detector still on me? Oh, I was just metal detecting. I'm like, why am I doing that? All right. That's why I have a lot of things on me. I have too much on me right now. Uh, let's see. Well, I should start moving some of these things over just so I have, don't have them in my way. Okay. Here we go. It's so hard just figuring out all the stuff you, you have for uh, welding. I mean, for making steel and stuff. Oh, you know what? Well, I didn't even talk about it. Yeah, while I was uh, searching with the metal detector, I found a dog whistle. Uh, who knew, right? No, I actually knew that that actually is a possibility that you could find a dog whistle. So we'll look for a dog, too. Um, I, I could use some more dogs. I think I have two pack dogs now. But we could use some more hunting dogs and things like that. It would be kind of nice. Um, don't need this umbrella on me. Don't need charcoal on me either. See, all this stuff is just weighing me down. Should put it down. There we go. And we also got to go through a lot of electronics and um, dismantle all this, but I want to read the books first before I do that. Okay, so can I make this? Large sheets of metal. Yep, we'll make all two because that's how many is required, I do believe. Yeah, two sheets of metal. Okay, no problem. Once that's finished, this dissection table should pop up for us. Uh, it's taking a second, huh? Maybe I should fast forward a little bit. There we go. All right, so that is done. And then all we need to do now is make this dissection table. Sweet. I want to try try it out today, too. Let's see uh, what we can do, get done. Uh, I'm assuming need a uh, saw, meat cleavers, things like that. Um, it also increase, it increases your first aid, so you learn a lot about like uh, first aid stuff. So I should probably read first aid books, but just to test it out and see what, what things we can dissect and everything and have a little fun with that. Um, and we'll put that, um, I don't want it, I was thinking about putting it upstairs, 
But to be honest with you, I kind of don't want it too far away from the ground level because I'm going to be hauling zombies back and forth. So maybe maybe even in, in the house, like make this a the kitchen dissection room now. How about like a living room? It's a living room event, right? Now, just for now, you know, it's not a big deal. Look at that. And we can walk through it, though, which, yeah, it's all right. All right. Uh, we also can search for a dog if we wanted to. Um, we're going to do that later. Uh, I need to put a little things away because I'm really overweight right now. And so let me put all this away and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, I'm back and I put everything away um, that's not necessary right now, but I guess we could just use the zombie that's right here. He has all this stuff on him though, so I mean, I'm gonna take all this off of him and uh, throw it on the ground, just for now. Um, and then we can grab this corpse. I also put my pack dog down just so then we have, uh, so, so we have room. Grab corpse. No, that's because I wasn't looking on the ground. Okay. Like, come on, man. Where are you? Oh, is this like one of those corpses that I just can't grab anything off of? Yeah, that's neat. Isn't that, that's just special, isn't it? Yeah, I should be able to see it right here. Oh, well, that corpse we're not grabbing. Unless I can right-click him. I don't think I can, though. No, grab corpse. Okay, yeah. There it is. All right, so I got the corpse. And can we just... Yeah, see, we got to do something with this. So I don't really know how this stuff works. We're going to try it out. Um, is it going to be in health, maybe? Um, dissect. Dissection table. Uh, bloody dissection table. Um, hmm. I don't know. Maybe like... Oh, dissect corpse. Okay, so we need the bone saw or... Or one of improvised scalpel or scalpels. Oh, we need a lot of things on us, huh? I might have to make a bone saw. I think I can, actually. Or, or a gig, giggly saw. I might have a bone saw somewhere. I have to look around to see if I actually have one. Uh, we can make an improvised scalpel. I think I might even have a scalpel. And then we need latex gloves. So we do need a few things. Um, I just can't go right to it and just start going, right? No. Okay, so let's put the corpse back down. Um, and then I think, I don't know where I would, I'd put it because it's not something I normally keep around. Scalpels and bone saws. Um, hmm. I think I actually have a bone saw upstairs. I have to take a look. I don't know if I have actual, actually picked up a bone saw or not. I know I have saws, but I don't have a, I thought you could use a regular saw, but oh well. We're going to have to have a bone saw, huh? Hmm. And a scalpel. Maybe there are some things we might have to look for. Um, what I'll do is I, I have to put another break in for you guys, so then you guys can, uh, so then I can tell you if I actually have this stuff or not, because I don't know if I do. So I'll be back, guys, in one second, because I don't think I have it totally organized for that, because I don't think it's something I would have grabbed. So if it's any, if it's anywhere, it's going to be in places that I don't normally uh, put stuff. I just put some uh, throwback and everything. So I'll be right back, guys. All right, you guys. I'm back and um, I looked around. I didn't find an actual bone saw. I did find a razor blade though. Um, also, um, I was taking a look at what if we can make a so we can make a scalpel. That's not a problem. Um, the other thing we need to make is and I had to read my books again too. So make sure you do that if you guys end up running into problems. We can make a giggly saw. So that's fine. Uh, we can deal with that. Luckily, we have that one steel ingot. I was like, oh cool, we have one more anyway. So that kind of worked out. Works out for me. Um, so where did I put the steel ingot? Okay, there it is. And then we need the steel smithy hammer, which should be in this box. Yeah. Okay, and I think that's it. Um, let me make sure. Um, steel smithy hammer, tongs. Oh, we should have some tongs on us. There we go. And the anvil. Let's go ahead and craft that. All right, so that's our... That's our giggly saw, so that's going to be one thing we need. We also need latex gloves. I didn't take a look for yet, and I'll probably pause you guys so I can find that too, because I don't think I have any. Um, it was either latex gloves or rubber gloves, um, so I'll probably need both of those. Okay, so the, the other thing I need is a little bit of glue and a sturdy stick. Come on, why don't you close for me? Sometimes it just doesn't want to do it. All right, so just some glue. I know I have glue, yeah. Definitely have glue. Let's get a 
little thing of glue, and we need a sturdy stick, which are pretty much all downstairs if I have any. Oh, actually, they're probably upstairs. I didn't even think about that. I have all those sturdy sticks up there. That's right. Or I have planks up there. I can make sturdy sticks with them. But I think I have uh, some sturdy sticks I put on the ground out here. I haven't been up here in a bit. Yeah, I didn't put any sturdy sticks on the ground. But that's okay. I have a plank right here. Um, let's go ahead and make um, sturdy sticks. Then that should be enough. And we should be able to make ourselves... Something temporary, at least, you know, make ourselves a nice little craft improvised scalpel. Sweet. It probably doesn't have that great of uh, durability, but that's all we needed in that. Um, I put these boxes here, but this is like bone powder and stuff like that. Uh, let's put some of this stuff away. I don't really need it on me. And then latex gloves, or let's see which ones. I think it was two different types. Um, that was in health. Okay, so dissect corpse. Okay, so put corpse on table. Well, that was another thing we didn't do. So I do need latex gloves or rubber gloves. So that's not, I think, I probably would have put it over here, but I'm not for sure. Rubber gloves or latex gloves. Yeah, there we go. There's some rubber gloves. Okay. Did I have any latex ones? It didn't really matter as long as I have rubber, as long as I have one of them. Okay. Now we should be able to grab this corpse and put it on the table at least. And let's, uh, I'm not going to do a lot with this today, but, you know, let, let's just do some, you know. Okay, so we go here, put corpse on table. Oh, nice! <laughs> uh, it moves the table though, I don't like that. Oh well. Okay, so we got dissection table. Now, we have a giggly saw, improvised scalpel. What are we missing here? What are we missing? Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see. Okay, so we did that. So to dissect corpse, we need that. We have a giggly saw. I just made one. Did I put it on the ground when I made it? No, it's right there. Oh, handle! A giggly saw handle. <laughs> oh man. Always one more thing, huh? Uh, let's go take a look. I, I should be able to make a giggly saw though. Gig. That's just the handle. Giggly saw handle. So then we need to make a giggly saw. Is that engineering? Maybe. Oh, maybe I don't have the recipe for it. Because I went through all my other books. So we get a giggly saw handle, but then how do we put a saw on it? Um... I don't know, that's like the handle, but um, you'd think it'd be like right in here. Saw. Let me just look up saw maybe. Make steel saw. Make giggly saw, saw handle. Huh. Um, am I going to have to like do something weird here? Giggly saw. Huh. I don't know, I'm, I'm going to have to think about that. Um. I wouldn't wouldn't think it's in here. Oh yeah, it is. Oh okay. And do we just need steel wire? <laughs> God, my it's in health. Wow, man, that's weird. Okay, that that's fine. That's fine. Um, steel wire. Um, I don't know if I have any steel wire. Let's go to bed. I don't I don't want to be up uh, during the night. Well, it's almost time to go to bed. In a second, we'll go to bed in a second. Okay. Ah, just to make another thing. Uh, steel steel wire. Steel wire. Steel. I don't. No, if I if it says steel wire and I have a whole bunch of wire, so that's not gonna count. So I gotta make steel wire. Am I gonna need more steel? Oh god, I hope not, because I really don't. I'm running out. Ah, uh, make steel wire. Yeah, steel ingot. Hmm. Oh, and we need a small rolling mill, so we need a lot of things to do this. This isn't gonna be a, a little joke. Oh well. So I think that'll be it then. Uh, well, we we'll at least got the corpse on the table today. Um, we'll play with it another time once we get a chance uh, to actually... I need some more steel wire. I'll have to make a, a rolling mill or something of that nature. Either you need um, a small rolling mill. That's not a problem. I can do that. So um, what does a rolling mill anyways take me to... What does it take to make one of those? So let's, let's, let's take rolling. Come on. 
Not in, uh, would it be carpentry? Sometimes he's in the spots roll. No. How about, uh, not engineering. It must be blacksmithing then. Yeah. Roll. No. Masonry. It's just weird. Maybe stone working. Oh, we'll check them all. I'll roll. No. Stone working. Oh, maybe it's uh, something else I'm not thinking of. Um, I think it is engineering. Um, but I'm just not. It's just not popping up for me. Um, mill. Okay, there we go. It's just yeah. It should. It should have been. A, it should have popped up when I put roll, but it just wasn't registering. We'd need steel rods, steel ingots. Once again, a lot of steel and everything. So, you know, we might have to go out. I think I actually have a crank laying around. But, um, yeah, we're just going to have to go out, probably get some more uh, get get some more goods. Because I'm running really low on, um, on steel. So I think that'll do it for today. So I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Uh, if you did, go ahead and hit that like button. And subscribe if you guys want to see further. Take it easy, guys. Thank you for watching. And have a wonderful day.